What's good, YouTube? We back here today again. Let me let me let me see what you got. Okay, okay. Oh, Start naming it. All right, we seen it. All right, so as some of y'all know, we uh recently got engaged, and she said, "Yeah, but no, I ain't do that." But um, so go ahead, say say what you guys say. Okay, guys, so. My birthday was eight days before the proposal, and I thought I was going to a birthday dinner with our family. He blindfolded me. I was, you know, crazy, scared. Um, but we were walking, and he was guiding me, and then I took the blindfold off, and I was confused. Like, I seen his family, and I seen some of my family that I didn't think was going to be there. And I didn't even realize that he was down there. <laughs> and I looked down and he had the box open with the ring and I just started crying like. Mm. <laughs> I was because y'all like, I was shocked, surprised, overwhelmed, like with everything. And then I finally said yes. After like five minutes, I'm like, are you gonna say no or like? Yeah, I couldn't get my words out. Like, I really was confused. Like, I wasn't expecting it. Like, I wanted to say yes, but it wouldn't come out until like after I like gathered my emotions. <laughs> like, what you gonna say? Like, yeah. And everybody was asking me like, why it took so long. Like, I could not get any words out. Like, I was shocked. Like. We talk about marriage all the time, but I didn't think that it was coming. So I really couldn't get the words out. And I was still trying to gather the fact that everybody was there from our family, his family, my family. Oh, well, yeah, our families. So, yes. All right, so... Mm, we had asked some people some questions. I think I got like two or three. I don't know if you got, I got a couple. Somebody asked, um, who was going to be my best man? Um, I got two people in mind, but I ain't, ain't, we not saying nobody in the, um, what's it called? Wedding party? Yeah, we not saying nobody in the wedding party names. I mean, some people know, but some people don't. So we ain't going to say no names who exactly, who, um, who is in it. So that's, that's that. But the people that do know, they... They already know. And another one is when we, um, how we meet? Where do we meet at? I got that one too, actually. Uh, yeah, I did. So, y'all, I was in college. I went to Spelman. Some of you may know. So, <laughs> Ain't nobody worried about none of that. <laughs> Anyways, I was home on Christmas break, and my high school does a Christmas classic every year where alum come back and the alum cheerleaders cheer. So I was cheering at the game, and he couldn't get, keep his eyes off me, y'all. He you kept know? looking at me. Because you I, told you, me. But I'm saying, you, you saying that because like. Because, I know. watching me, though. I lo just a little bit. Nah, I don't know a little bit. <laughs> so, yeah, I just like. I, so, it was like during the game, he had added me on Snap. So, <laughs> I was telling my friend, I was like, oh, shoot. Like, he just added me on Snap. So, I, you know, accepted it. And then after the game, he was like, what did you say? Like, I hey, can I get your number or something like that? I forgot what it was. I don't know. Can't really tell how the conversation went, but he did ask for my number. And I said yes. But y'all, I didn't give him my number <laughs> after I said yes. So then he messaged me again, was like, so you going to send it? Like, she going to say yeah <laughs> and not give me a number. Like, what type of... Like, who's that? Like, so I gave him my number and then we started texting and so on and so on and yeah. so on. But um what other questions you got? Because I ain't gonna ask we ain't gonna um, ask any questions. I got how long have we been together? So we have been together two and a half years. Um that just came this July on the tenth was two and a half years. Um yes, yeah, it's, it's really like Seem like it's been so long. I feel like it's been like five, six yeah. years. Yeah. Like. Um, another, the next question I have is who said I love you first? He did, of I, course. I did. We were in Florida on a vacation for my birthday. And he said it. And I was just like, huh? I did. And I was.
was just like, wow, like, this is official. No, for real. But I knew he loved me. I was just waiting on him to say it. Um, I have, what was the first argument? It was a lot of arguments. <laughs> it's been a lot of arguments, but. Covid coming back. Don't say that. <laughs> but um, <laughs> our first argument. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Our he first might. argument. Um, I don't really know our first argument. I can't say like because we'll we argue. Haven't... We'll argue over little stuff. Yeah, that's like, what I was about to say. Over little little stuff, <laughs> and then like ten minutes later, it don't even matter anymore. Uh, I, don't, I, I, can't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. That means we really don't argue over serious things. It, like you said, just little petty stuff. It'd be like, we'll argue when we about to go. Who you want to eat? Who you want? Like today, example, <laughs> today. Who you want to eat? I don't know. I think I want Chick fil A. You want Chick fil A? I don't know. I think I want McDonald's. Which one is it? What do you want? Like, do you want Chick Fil A or you want McDonald's? I mean, y'all, I'm very indecisive. So, and it's just, I heard other people say they go through the same thing. Like, I don't. Is it just women in general, or just, just say what you want to eat? I don't. Whatever you want, I want. Yeah, it's just every day. What do you want? What do you want? Cause he acts like he can't tell me what he wants to eat. And it's, it's like always sometimes me deciding. we're just we're just not even eat. It's just crazy. Yeah, anymore. Um, I have. What was the first date? Um, the first date was like, what was it like two, three weeks after we started taking? I think so. Yeah. We had went to the movies and we had seen um, what was it called? I know what was it about, but what was it called? Um, the escape room. Yeah. Or the ex something. Escape, something escape room. And it was pretty weird because it ended in like a like a plot twist kind of, and they never make a second one. Yeah. Because the way it ended, remember they was like, came outside? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I thought it was going to be. Yeah, I've never seen that nothing about it. I don't know. But, y'all, our first date was literally like the day before I was leaving to go back to school. I was going to California. The night before. Yeah, it was the night before. I was going to California, then I was going back to school. So, y'all, like, I just knew, like, after that date, it was going to be it. I was like, we ain't never going to talk. Like, I'm going back to Georgia. He's going to be in Virginia. And this was like, what? It was in January. So, we just started. Keep, we kept talking and all that. And then February, a couple weeks later, my birthday, I flew down there. And then I ended up going down there a lot more. And then she came back home. And then we, we moved together, everything. Now we engage. And it's just, I don't know. It's just crazy. <laughs> to think back then that everything was going to Yeah, happen. I did not think this was going to happen. Like, I yeah. really, I didn't, like, I didn't think he was going to talk to me after I went back to school. I was like, y'all, he going to be in Virginia, and he just going to cut me off, and I'm going to just be in Atlanta, like, okay, whatever. Like, <laughs> that's what you really. see. You said it, not me. Nah. But no, like, I just really so. didn't think it was going to work, like, because I started feeling him, he was feeling me. But I was like, we in two different states. But like you said, he came down there. Like he came down there every single month. My second semester, senior year. Like he even came back and helped me move out from Georgia, and we drove back, did a road trip from Georgia back to Virginia. So yeah, and here we are, engaged. Anymore. I have one more. Okay. Who snores the loudest? That's you. That's you. No, no it's that's you. you. It's you. you. Not no, loud. I'm like, pretty sure you it's you. Snoring like you. Like, <laughs> like and you so worse. Good. Like I, no. I have to move you, or like tap Ooh, you like so that, that I do so that way well, you can stop snoring. You turn over, and then you start back yeah, again. It's, it's definitely her. She definitely. Be, she yeah. be tired. She act like she done. I don't know. Then ran and a you marathon. You have the same. That, I really do be running marathons though. That's yeah, you be you snoring be, real loud. Be like I be so mad. That's why I be going to sleep first. If I don't go to sleep first, no, you I can't like sleep with you. No, 
I was on the phone with my friend, like my one of my closest friends, and she heard him snore. That's because you had the phone beside me. No. She was like, is that him snoring? I was like, yes, this is what we deal with. But those are all the questions that I have. Oh, one that I got, I'm sorry. One question I did get from like a couple people um, was how was I so dressed up like and didn't know. But I literally, like I said, thought I was going to a early birthday dinner. But it just happens to been my I, engagement. I was, I was like, I was nerve wracked the whole time. <laughs> but I mean, it, it worked. Everything worked out fine. And he really pulled it off, y'all. I'm, uh, I'm gonna show the video and the pictures on there, so they can see exactly what happened. What happened? Yeah. And when you almost said no. I was never gonna say no. I just couldn't get my words out. But um, we probably keep oh, going God. with some more wedding yeah. stuff whenever stuff happens. Yeah. I know today we went and looked at a venue and we probably that. we should have should have go for but um we, we can do it we can do it next time but um we probably do that venue send you for news but um yeah like comment subscribe do whatever do all that and if you like the video <laughs> like the video my boy Nick Marks but uh yeah, um, stay tuned for what's next. Thank you for watching. Peace.